Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am so excited. I am doing my 2022 decorate for Christmas with me video. And this is one of my favorite videos to do every single year. I think I started in 2019. Um, I'm going to show you quite a few different areas around the house. And most of the things that I got this year are Walmart, Amazon, Target. And then we did get a big new massive 12 foot Christmas tree from Wayfair that I can't wait to share with you guys. We stopped into Target and got a few last minute finds yesterday. So this is kind of the vibe that I'm going for. Very gold, white, snow, all that. And I really got inspiration from, basically I want my house to look like a Snowden village. Um, this is actually a little Samsung frame TV art from Etsy. And if you guys have a Samsung frame TV, switching out your art is so much fun. So this is the tree. This is a 12 foot tree. It is so big and I want this to just look like a like winter wonderland in here. So I'm so excited. We do have some um, plastic down because of all the flocking, it gets out of control. We all um, went into Target yesterday and grabbed a few other finds that I will share with you guys. So this is also kind of like my inspiration for the tree, very gold, silver. Love this little tree. This does come in two different colors. I think I'm gonna use it on like a mantle or something. I just think it's so cute. And then how adorable are these, you guys? I literally love these. They're five bucks. I got this one that has the gold and then I got this one that has the gold with the white. I thought this thing was really fun. I keep seeing it on TikTok and Instagram. It's kind of like a faux fur little Christmas tree. I don't know how I'm gonna style it yet, but I think it's really fun. And then I love these branches. So this is the color scheme that I'm going with this year. Gold, silver, all the frosted vibes. Let me pick up one and show you up close. Isn't this so pretty? I seriously love this one. It's five bucks. It is shipping. So if you're um, shopping online, it will be linked in my video description box. And then look at the gold one. How pretty is that? So a mix of those is gonna be so pretty in here. Okay, so I already decorated this console table and I did inc incorporate a little bit of black elements in it just because in our house, you know, with the fireplace being black and we do have like a lot of black pieces that I love to decorate our shelves with. So I wanted to bring in some black on this table, even though I'm mostly gonna do like silver, white and gold. But anyways, so these are some of my favorite trees. You guys have probably seen me share these on other videos from Walmart. They do plug in with LED lights. They're so pretty and they come in this like really cool black basket. Um, this has like just little pieces from Target throughout the years on it. Some of these really, pretty little trees. I'm pretty sure they still have these. Um, a very similar little deer, to like the one that I showed you guys earlier. And then this garland is the best garland. I'm actually gonna show it to you guys when we do our mantle later too. It's nine foot, it's um, flocked, and it has different kind of stems on it too, if you wanna come show it like a little closer. Like, it's not just this kind of stem, which is pretty much like a, trip, a typical like Christmas tree, but it also kind of has some of this, which I think gives it something, and like the pine cones. I just love these um, garlands, and they're like $22, so they're really affordable, and I use them every single year. Um, then on the bottom of the console, which I love this console, because you can do so many different things with it. I got it from Wayfair. I think it's Joss and Maine. I can link it for you guys. Um, but what we did was added these cute little um, houses from Target. They still have these this year. I got these a couple years ago. And then I did just a couple um, coffee table books. Don't look too closely at my nails because they're messed up. I have two nails on. And <laughs> these really pretty candles from Walmart. I got these a couple years ago and I, they still have them. They're so pretty. I love the little tin. They see like peace or they have different sayings and then they have a little garland on them. I also did one basket in the middle, which will put like a cozy blanket in. And then I did two of these, which are both from Walmart as well. Okay, follow me into our little Christmas wonderland. <laughs> we literally redid this tile in this room and then we literally just stuck all the Christmas decor in here. So a lot of this is from the attic storage unit stuff from last year. And then some is from this year. All the ornaments that we're gonna use, um, some new stuff from Walmart, lots of faux fur and gold. Oh my goodness, I'm tripping. Oh man. 
We have too much Christmas decor. This is getting out of control. <laughs> so stuff from Amazon, like look how cool these are. These are actually Wayfair, but like little picks like this so we can just poke into the tree. I'm so excited for this tree. I might be overdoing it, but I want to stick with this color theme throughout other trees in my house. Like these Walmart trees, I really want to put one of these bad boys in the dining room um, because they're so pretty and I think they'll be so nice when we're eating Christmas dinner. Oh look, I'm gonna put the two red ones right there. <laughs> so cute. Um, yeah, so this is the madness behind the scenes. This is what it looks like in here right now. <laughs> All right, another area that we're gonna work on that I love to include in the decor is the dining area because it's so open in our house. And typically it's just an area where we throw stuff. <laughs> but we're gonna do a Christmas tree right here this year. And then we're going to decorate this for Christmas. I'm gonna like take out some of the stuff, move it back so it doesn't look so cluttered in there. A lot of it will come out and do like the dining room table for Christmas. And then I think I'm gonna take the record player and move it over here on a bar cart because I love to play like, pretty sure I have my Michael Buble Christmas in here. Let's see. Yep. Love to play this. Got this bad boy on Waker and it feels so cool and old school. So excited for this area because it's kind of cozy to come in here. Honestly, it'd be cool too if it was like a sitting area for Christmas. We've thought about like, like taking the dining room table and moving it into storage and making a cool sitting area because we don't eat in here that much. We always eat in the other area. You guys eat in your dining room? I feel like we never do. And I can promise Santa's coming to visit. No, he wouldn't miss it. In Christmas times. Oh. All right, we also finished the dining room and it looks so good. We kind of did the same vibe with this tree. Same colors. This is a Walmart tree actually though and it's such a nice tree. Really good quality, really good pricing. I love these too. These were from Amazon. I love these. And then I just did really simple over here. Um, I did my garland from Walmart. I did these stems from um, Target and then these cute little deer and I did a few candles and then I have my record player over here for some Michael Buble. I haven't really decorated that yet, but this is what I have so far. All right guys, I'm working on this. I typically do a like the same garland that I showed you on the console table. I typically do that here, but I'm like, I wanna change it up a little and add more gold. So these are from Walmart. Dylan's filming me by the way, my husband, he's here. <laughs> Say hello behind the camera, Dylan. Hello. <laughs> um, these are really pretty and I figure I'll try these and then maybe I can add some little sprigs, like flocked sprigs as well. But I'm doing two of them across our mantle so we can have like a little bit of a hanging effect on the side as well. That underneath there, there we go. And then for um, stockings, we love the Pottery Barn ones because we spent like money on them, customizing them. Um, so this is the ones we got like a few years ago and they say our names on them, which I just thought was, I don't know, so sweet to do. And I got them all different styles. But if you're looking for some ones that are from Walmart, I have some options I'm gonna share with you guys. These are from, it's My Texas Home. She's an influencer and she has a collection at Walmart, which if Walmart, if you're watching, like we need to do that together soon. <laughs> um, so these are so pretty and they come in multiple styles and they're super nice. This is a faux fur one. This still has a cardboard in it, so it's kind of stiff. This one has a snowflake on it and you guys, these are $9.99. So, and they're pretty long too. I can show you the comparison. This is a really pretty faux fur and then this is a faux fur. They're really, really nice quality. Let me show you the difference in length. So I'll grab my Pottery Barn one. It's honestly, you know what? It might even be a little bigger than our Pottery Barn ones. So they're $10. So if you don't care about the customization on them, look, it's, it's a little longer. They're really nice. I mean, they're super nice. I'll show you another one. This one's actually more expensive from Walmart. These are $12.98, but they're smaller but they're really cute. So they go with like the faux fur stuff that I got. Like how cute, I love these. So I think I'm gonna use these like in a different area and kind of do like some sort of string or garland in between them and put them like over like a buffet or something. Kind of like strung together because I just think that they're so pretty and I love the faux fur. These are, what did I say, $12.98 at Walmart. And then all of these ones, I will link in the video description box because these, 
The quality and the size is super, super nice for, for the $9.98 price. Okay, I feel like I don't like the gold by itself, so I'm gonna try to kind of intertwine it with this garland. This is another um, Walmart garland. It's just like their most basic one, but it is flocked, and I love this one. So it's a great one to just use on, you know, down a table or on a buffet and it's more affordable than the other one. So I'm just gonna try to intertwine it together and see what I can do. I think it will work, because I want a little bit of green. I don't want just the gold, because it's almost looking like too yellow with all the green I already have in here. So I think that this will be really pretty. All right, so I think I like this so much better because it brings in some of the green. I think I have to still like kind of fix it in some spots. This one seems like it has more yellow, um, but I feel like if we had our TV was higher up, I'd probably add more like maybe little ornaments or like little white picks. Like we could even do like some of these. There's just so many ways you could do garland. I mean, this might be pretty to add some of these too. We'll see. I kind of want to use these in a vase, but there's multiple ways to do it. I feel like the combo of those two and they're both pretty affordable. I think that's a pretty, a really pretty combo. Okay, I don't know if you guys have ever made a simmer pot, but they smell so good. It smells like our, our whole house just smells like Christmas. Oh, I love it. And they have recipes for them on Pinterest all over the place, but it just gets us in the mood. And now we're going to do the giant Christmas tree. So I'm so excited to see how it turns out. I'm kind of nervous. It's like so big and I want to make it perfect, but it's going to be good. All right, guys, it's done. How does it look? I kind of still want to add a little more ornaments, which is kind of crazy, but I kind of want to put a little more white in, but I feel like it looks so good. We use so many different kind of things, like little poinsettias, little stems, little picks, big ornaments, small ornaments, ribbon, just like mixed in a bunch of different things, but stuck to the same color scheme. And I literally love it. it looks so good. I love these little champagne ones too. These are so pretty. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching our Decorate With Me video. If you guys wanna see more Christmas videos, I did do like a Christmas tree review from Walmart and I did like two Walmart Christmas decor hauls. And I'm sure we're gonna do more. And it's, we're gonna definitely It's do early more. November. It's so. early November. We wanna have the kids in more of it, but they're in school. We were like looking at our old ones from the last couple of years. If you go back to 2019 on my channel, my Christmas Decorate With Me video is like my number one yeah. viewed video. And Eva was a baby, Noah Eva was, was so small. Little. They were so cute. Now they're both in school. Emma did get to help a little bit, but I'm like, girl, we have so many trees to decorate together. <laughs> so, well, thank you guys again for watching and we'll see you on the next video. We'll be chilling and having a good, good time.